It's a big, powerful 4x4. But when the going gets tough, it bears its claws to climb over anything that gets in its way. The animal clawing its way to the top. The tiger paw, the tiger paw. Can anyone stop the tiger paw? Hey guys, welcome back to the 5R show. I'm your host Raymond. And as you can see, today we're talking about Japan's version of the Galoob toy, the animal. Okay, so as you know that the American version is called the animal, the tiger paw. So it was rebranded as the tiger paw. It isn't called the animal like it is in the US. It is the same toy and even that is questionable. But it is the same toy brand but it is named the tiger paw hence the tiger here. Now I know that the US had a tiger as well but it was called the animal. So uh, I'm not sure why they rebranded in the US but in Japan they do like tigers, okay? They, they're very uh, accepting of nature. That's Japan's way. So anyway, on the sticker here on the side, you can see it, it says the tiger paw. On the artwork, you can see here, it says the tiger paw. It was made by a company, Taiyo, which means sun. And here is the logo for Taiyo. But, it is licensed by Galoob. So they did get permission from Galoob. And on the side, you can see the toy, the Tiger Paw four wheel drive. Um, Tora no Tsume, the nails of the tiger. Motsuya Sei no Machine. I'm not sure what that says, but uh, I'm guessing it says that it, they pop out from the machine, or it's a machine that has that ability. So anyway, here's the back. And if you'll notice carefully, it says here, Tayo made in Japan. Okay. So you can see that it's yellow. You can unlock it. It's red. You lock it. Okay. But then here on the bottom, you've got pictures of lamps. It, it's, it shows light. And here, which I've never seen before, lucky to have just found this one. But you've got the play set, which I'm assuming it might be the same as the US version, if there was one in the US. But here you've got a, another Hilux with a camper. The one I have, which is a Hilux with a spare tire. And then here, which I originally thought was a Mustang, is actually a Skyline. So it must be a Nissan Skyline. And so I looked it up on a Japanese website that's what they call it is the the tiger paw skyline so it must be a nissan you know but for those of you who would say now that's a bootleg no here's the box 1984 lewis galoop toys incorporated all rights reserved sold by tayo kogyo corporation limited in japan so it is legitimate this is a legitimate toy it is not a bootleg it's not fake it's not chinese this is the real deal ladies and gentlemen the tiger paw now i picked this up at a, a thrift store and i was really shocked at what i had seen uh, i picked it over a star wars lego of course i had rather go vintage so here has the instruction the tiger paw and so here's the uh, instructions uh, unlock the uh, front part to install the batteries. You get 4D batteries you got to put in there. Here you've got the on off switch. And then on the back, of course, it talks to you about how you have to lock and unlock the tires. It gives you explicit instructions. And I'm guessing sometimes when it's in red, it tells you what not to do. Okay. And then, of course, it comes with some of the inserts, which I was kind of having a hard time figuring out how the inserts go. So I just left them alone because I have no idea how that works. But anyway, 
go on to the toy. All right, and here we are, the Tiger Paw. As you can see, it's got a sticker here that says the Tiger Paw. The wheels all say the Tiger Paw, 4x4, four four, the Tiger Paw. Uh, on the front, you've got the sticker of the Tiger here, and then, of course, you've got Tiger Paw written right there. On the back, you've got the spare tire, Fierce, the Tiger Paw, four-wheel drive pickup. So I don't know, but I know this is the truck that's in the uh, initial original U.S. Galoob commercial for the animal. But it, the original did not have that option. So I'm wondering if this is Japan only. If you know any better, please let me know in the comments below. Uh, again, this one has the locking feature. So when the wheels are on red, they're locked. But when they're on yellow... They're unlocked. And so we are unlocking it. And now we're gonna turn it on and see what happens, okay? Can anything stop it? Yep, a wall. <laughs> so, all right, and now I'm gonna turn off the lights just for a moment. And there you go. And so, as you can see, that is really cool when it comes to this toy. Uh, yes, the front comes with 4D batteries, okay? Uh, and yeah, of course. Uh, it makes the batteries are what makes it heavier but I guess that's what it needs that power where it's the tires the claws and then you've got the uh, high beams or the lamp and the and the headlights and that's why you probably needed those four D batteries on the bottom here you'll see that it's got the on off switch and again it's just super heavy you know but check this out says Tayo on there. Patent pending Tayo. 1984 Lewis Galoob Toys Incorporated. And so again, it is legitimate. This toy is officially a Japanese the animal toy from Galoob. Now here's the sad thing. I scoured the internet. Uh, the, the limited Japanese I have, I scoured. I looked and I looked and I looked and I tried anything possible to try to find out if there was a video or a commercial. I could find none. There are some pictures of the other versions. But as far as I know, there's only the three. The only three. The initial three with the Tiger Paw box. What I don't know is if there are any other Tiger Paws released after the initial three. And so that's one of the things is that it could have, there could have been others, but from what I've found online, there's only the initial three. I've never seen any, the, any of the other extended uh, toys that were released in the US. I could be wrong, but from what research I did, I could not find any more than those three. So anyway, that does it for today's The Tiger Paw. You know, um, can anything stop it? Some guy said in a comment somewhere, yeah, some stairways can stop it. So yeah, of course, anything, some things can stop this toy. But when you're a kid, this kind of a truck it makes you think you're unstoppable. And I guess that's what Galoo was counting on. So anyway, that does it for today's episode on the Tiger Paw. If you haven't considered yet, please do so and subscribe to the channel. Share, like, comment. Let us know what you think of Japan's version of the animal, the Tiger Paw. Thanks again for watching. God bless you, take care, and I will see you guys on the next episode of The 5-Hour Show.